Nintendo instead of All my right. Life. All right. We we are we've got 40 minutes left on the show and that means it's going to be crap. I got time for one review. No, no, dude, because <laughs> here here you've got time for six reviews, brother, because uh, th- th- uh we're about to drop our epileptic twist on you. Are you ready? I am ready. All right. We're going to do six reviews, okay? Each review will be timed. They will be no longer than five minutes. So if we do not finish our review in five minutes, we will go on to the next one. As Grandmaster Timekeeper, DJ Rome over there, has his, uh, has his little timekeeping device there. And he will be cutting us off. He will be cutting our mics. He will be saying, going to the next oh, review. The moderator. So it, it, it's he, like last comic standing. You're just going to cut the mic exactly. off. Exactly. I have the power. That's all I'm going to say. It, for, for Rome it. has the power. So here's the deal. We've got to put some stipulations. Are you going to at least give us like minute warnings? Like four minutes. Negative. Three minutes. No, <laughs> dude, come on. Give him a 30 second All right, warning. dude. I will hey. give you a one minute warning. What? I'll give you the one minute warning. Should I give you the two minute warning? No, one we'll minute. Go NFL one minute. style. All right. One minute. Uh, one, one minute. minute one is, minute yeah. warning. That sounds fair okay. enough. Okay. Right. So. Hey, listen. Wait a minute. What? While while we're doing this show, you need someone on your crew to find me an article on the internet that says the GameCube controller can be used with. Zip. All right. All eg. No, it does. It does need to be you. We'll, we'll get. All right. We'll it. set it out oh, to listen, the audience. I'm sure Fat Baby is already correcting me if I'm wrong. So <laughs> yeah, where is go, Fat Baby? Hold on, baby, hold on, dude, Fat cause... Baby. Shit! You can't play the Wii version of Zelda with the GameCube controller. All right. I knew. Did did I? I mean. He's that on baby, point, dude. He loves to correct me. That's, and you want to know what? Lives. I'm pissed that you're the host. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it sounded good. I'm sure that someone will come out for a hack, but... I mean, I'm, ho- I'm, I'm hoping that you guys have that in your clips, especially your blooper clips, where he brags that he knows what's up because he's the host. Nope, I have, I have the power to cut that shit out. That's the beauty of post-production. He's going to edit to have me saying he is... Best. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's classic. All right. So, are you ready, Timekeeper? I am ready. Okay, Force, we need a game plan here. I'm thinking we should do Luminous first because that should take less than five minutes. Go for it. All right. Uh, are, are you ready? I'm you, ready. Uh, 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 Rome, are you ready? Yes, sir. Okay. So here's what's going to happen, Rome. When our five minutes is up for Luminous, not only are you telling us that the five minutes is starting, but you're also telling us which game we're going on to. Okay. So we get to choose the first game, and we're choosing Luminous because that should be the easiest one. From that point forward, you pick a game. Mike, if it's Roger. one that we've both played, we get to comment on. If it's one that only I have played, I'll do it. If it's only one that you played, you'll do it. Got it? We good? We I'm good? ready. Let's do it. We've got we've – got, 35 minutes left in the show, so there should be five minutes left when we're done. Are we ready? Ready. Rome, tell us when to go. And go. Okay, so Luminous came out originally on the PSP, right? Great game. It was awesome music. The guy that made it, you know, basically came up with an innovative puzzle game. While you're playing the game, which is basically four blocks of two different colors, you create larger blocks with those colors. They go away to the beat, and the whole game is kind of like composing your own song while you're playing. Always a cool concept. They finally decided to release it on Xbox Live. Now, what are the good things about releasing it on Live? They've got a multiplayer uh, ability for you to be able to play uh, other people. I don't particularly like the multiplayer. It's not that great. And, uh, you know, I would say one of the really bad things about it is the fact that not only are you going to pluck down, like, what, 1,200 Microsoft points to play the game, to buy the game, to have the unlocked version, but you're going to pay another 400 Microsoft points to actually get the additional content in the game. That sucks balls because Luminous is a great game. I think it's probably worth about 800 Microsoft points. Definitely not 1,200 Microsoft points, despite the fact that my wife and I played the hell out of it. Now, Force, have you purchased Luminous? Hell no. <laughs> okay. And why not? For one thing, it costs that much. I'm not paying 15 bucks if I'm not getting the complete game. Okay. We're looking at, what, 35 to $40 for the entire game. Not me. Wouldn't do it. You know, I don't know if I would buy it for 40 bucks on a DVD-ROM and bring it home. Another problem that I have with it is that I played it on the PSP too much. Okay. When you okay. play it on a little screen, you get in the zone, and I played on my big ass TV, and it's, it's, I don't know, it's just not as smooth. And the controller, I don't think, 
I don't like the D-pad on the three. Yeah, the D-pad's really tough, actually. It. And I told you that there's another way to play it, that you could play it with the shoulder buttons. Did you try that? That, I, you know what? I was playing it with the analog stick, and you suggested the D-pad. Now i got to go back and try it again for a third control Are you stick. sure that I didn't say the, the shoulder buttons? You know, I don't know. I, I oh. started it with the analog. Maybe you should I try to use your wave exact. bird controller to play it. <laughs> I, I should. <laughs> All right. But the, the thing is, is that the controls are just not as tight. Okay, so. Not as tight as I'm used here's, to. In okay, let, so here's another thing. Like, my wife is just awesome at puzzle games, right? Your wife is equally awesome at puzzle games. Jen's high score is like 300 or 400,000 pretty good right she ranks about like 700 on the grand scheme of xbox live uh high scores the guy in first place has 32 million points now jen plays for 300,000 points and she's played for 50 minutes what the hell are these people doing wow we, we may have found people beyond not having a life playing world of warcraft because some poor fool actually decided to uh. sit there for hours upon hours and hours and play through 32 million points of luminous does that just blow your mind that does blow my mind all right do you yeah. know something else that i want to point out that pisses me off about what's luminous the, what's i want you to know that i was really really excited about it is that one of the things they bragged about was music videos in the background and that it looked all the screenshots that they showed had that Madonna music video in the background. Right. And that's not coming out for months. Right. Right. So it's like I'm I just don't feel like I'm getting what they promised, and it it really really upsets me when they drop it to maybe twenty bucks for the whole package, include music videos. I'm all over it. All right. So I do have an update, by the way, for us. You All right, can, I'm ready. You can play the GameCube version of Twilight Princess on the Wii with the GameCube controller. There wow. you go. There's right. your solution. Well, I was planning on buying the GameCube version no matter what. So. Okay. All right. Well, uh, I guess I'll anyway, change my Christmas enough. list. All right. Honestly, Luminous, um, unless you're like an Xbox Live arcade game whore, and, or unless you're huge into uh, you know a huge into these types of puzzle games then you know what, Luminous isn't all that great. Now, you know, my wife and I enjoy playing it. Do I, do I kind of regret having spent 1,200 points on it? Mm, yeah, a little bit. Um, actually, yeah, uh, a lot. As I say, but, if it keeps the wife quiet, it's worth twice that. I mean, I mean, the thing is, is that I could have bought Mortal Kombat 3 instead, and the bottom line is that Mortal Kombat 3 on the uh, Xbox controller is is worthless. Uh, that game sucks. I'm glad you said that because that one sucked um, too. I'm I haven't not... been impressed with any of the remakes or redos. Yeah, I, I haven't Street really Fighter 2 I was pumped about either. too, and that let me down. It, it did definitely let me down. I thought it was pretty crappy. So Get some original content. Yeah. Um, Anyway, so, all right. I, I think we're done with Luminous. I think that we safely beat five minutes. With six whole seconds six to Six seconds spare, to bro. go. All right. All right. Booyah. Booyah. <laughs> all right. So, next game.